Well, hello, you wonderful humans, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. I hope everybody's having a, a great day. Uh, clearly, my internet is not. Are you serious? Of all things, the god dang internet. Are we stabilized? No. Good lord. Just cannot catch a break. Hold on. Hoping that, uh, that this will fix it. I think we're good now. Maybe. Haha, -ha, okay. Ah, uh, the joys of having multiple internets, because internets, because you never know which one in Georgia is going to die. Oh, my lord. <laughs> okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Oh my god, I'm eating cheese. Welcome back to Stardew Valley. We are at the very tail end of our second year. And we still have quite a few um, things to complete. I feel like 150 is pretty good. I feel like this feels pretty good. A Sawyer Cave live stream. Nice. Um, but yeah, so we're on our we're on, we're on our second year. At the very end, we still have to get 500,000 more uh, gold so we can buy the scepter before the end of the season. We also have to finish off the museum, and we have to get all of our dinosaurs uh, to finish off the challenges that we had set up for this season. Uh, so, I don't know if we're going to do it all, but we're going to darn well try. But yeah, hope everybody's having a great day. Thank you for coming to hang out, you wonderful beans. If you do find yourselves enjoying the live stream, a like would be greatly appreciated. It's been a bit of a rough day. But we are keep on keeping on, you know? The only way we know how to do. Uh, let's see what our luck is like today. Uh, fortune teller. Spirits are in good humor today. That means finally, finally have a good luck day. Which hopefully is good. What happens if we fail? Do we restart? Uh, you know, never. Oh, we got Abigail sent our horse back. Oh, baby, it's a good day. <laughs> Abigail Centaur is back. The dunce cap still. I, I deserve the dunce cap. I am the dunce now. You know, like it's been, it's been a minute of me not doing so great things. So it's about time we just embrace the dunce that we are, and I'm okay with it. You know, I'm okay with it. I haven't earned. Anything other than the dunce cap yet. So until then, I remain a dunce. What exactly do I do in Sardew Valley? Exactly what we're doing now. Whatever our hearts desire. Whatever it could be. We could milk cows. We could play with some chickens. We can go into the mines. We can fall in love with everybody in town if we so desire. Uh, year three is going to be the year of love. Yeah. We're going <laughs> to... We're going to marry everybody in town. It's going to be really good. Uh, we'll have to think of some more challenges um, as well. Uh, but for the most part, it's going to be the year of love. Hey, Tag. I haven't got anything particularly interesting to say. Anyway, I hope this was helpful. Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit. Scott, thank you for the three months and the real maple syrup. I just learned that the Norwegian Navy paints huge barcodes on the side of all their ships. This, oh, I know exactly where this is going to end. This is so when the fleet comes in, they can scan the Navy in. Oh, boy. Oh, Billy. Hot diggity dang. <laughs> Absolutely terrible. But that's the way dad jokes are meant to be. So on that note, I suppose it's amazing. There we go. It's looking pretty good. What are you doing? I'm just trying to watch tag as it keeps crashing. Oh, boy. Yeah, I could not schedule the stream for the life of me. I uh, 
I spent pretty much in like an hour and a half trying to get the stream going, trying to fix things and all that stuff, and it was just uh, not happening. I'll hail Chaos Daddy for pinging the Discord to get more eyes on the stream. Yes. Also, I finally have a new Astro image uh, that I've been working on for a hot minute now. I figure uh, maybe we'll share that. Caden, for the love of God. Holy guacamole. <laughs> Caden just got in a fight with a cat. Um, so yeah, this is the um, this is a supernova called the Eastern or Western Veil, vale, also known as the Witch's Broom. And this is actually a six panel mosaic from my big telescope. So there's like three panels this way and three panels this way. And uh, you can zoom all the way up inside of this bad boy. It's looking really good. This is an old supernova from 10,000 years ago that I photographed with my very own telescope. Not James Webb. Me. Moi. Yours truly. Uh, and it's just really cool to look at like all of this little detail in here. I'm pretty happy with the way this one came out. It's the only image I've got this year. I just figured out... Um, I just figured out I can play the piano in Elliot's Beach Shack. Tried playing songs for way too long. Oh, no. Oh, no. Need that to be a blankie? It will be. YouTube keeps kicking you off. Just got kicked to a different video. God dang it. So it's not fixed. Um, all right, let me take a screenshot of this. We might have to, uh, we might have to cancel the stream. Getting that too. I thought it was the internet. Most of you, if you're getting that, you might have to refresh. There has been something going on. I'm going to give you all a second before we, uh, before we continue the stream. You got kicked a couple of times too. Refreshing helped. Had to refresh, but it seems fine now. Okay. We'll give it a second. We'll give it a second here. Let's do this while we're waiting for uh, the universe to fix itself. We'll have some real life time, you know? My girlfriend told me I was terrible in bed. I told her it's unfair to make a judgment in less than a minute. Oh, God. That's like so many burns on... <laughs> I've refreshed. I'll keep you posted. Oh, great. Now this camera doesn't want to go into focus. My whole life is a mess, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to it. Uh, don't forget to hit that like button, y'all. I keep getting kicked to the stray stream. Show the plushie. I don't want to show the plushie when YouTube's breaking. You were kicked twice, but you're good now. Plushie. Show the plushie. Y'all want a plushie? It's in here. It's in here. It's right in here. From beautiful makeship. If it helps, I'm having the same day today. Although, we did have a good day earlier. Um, so, I do want to say thank you to all of the people who helped uh, test out uh, the Stardew Valley server earlier today. Some exciting things are coming down the pipes. And today we did our first little test to uh, basically test the stability of the things that are being built for it. Um, and it all worked. Like, yeah, there were some kinks, as you all know. But the main thing we tested was the thing that worked really, really well. So good news. Very good news. It was a good day on that part. But, uh, yeah, we got a, we got a little something something in here. A little something something that's going to be released in sometime this month. I bet you all want to see what it is. Does that pink bag come with the plushies? It does. This bag does, in fact, come with the plushies. Just got your blanket. You love it. Nice. 
Rude. <laughs> Show us the goods. I'm waiting for YouTube to stop being a turd nugget. I love bags. I'm part cat, I swear. <laughs> Alright, what were we doing? Other than torturing the community. Um, right, it's 11. We can finally go to the thing. So you're, maybe if YouTube stops being a turd nugget, we'll, uh, we'll show you what's in the bag. I landed an entry-level job in my dream field. Cannabis, oh my lord. Uh, as I earn my degree to be an engineer in that industry. Can't wait to grow <laughs> with y'all. Oh my lanta. Nice. Congratulations. Congratulations. So we need bombs. We have 59 of those. Let's sell the other stuff that's in our inventory. Abigail Horace, you be thick. All up in my way. Well, we'll put the rest in this gray chest. Just don't want to risk losing any of my goods, you know? Got that. Can sell that. I need the bones anymore. I'm going to sell those three golden pumpkins. Because we can always get more. I'm just going to sell a lot of this stuff. That I don't necessarily need right meow. I think I've already given those in. Just want to store the rest of this. And I think we're good. Aw, oh, studs. Where'd our boo go? He's just gone. All right. All right, game. Wait, there he is. Oh, I was checking out the kids' room. I just want to say that I appreciate all your hard work you do for our household. Oh! Such a sweetie pie. So sad I couldn't help earlier with the Stardew stuff, but I had poop sleep last night and had to leave work early because of headache. Oh no. Also, I wish you... Russian bots for keeping me away from my baby. Oh my god. <laughs> Tiffany, I hope you uh hope you're feeling better now. <laughs> so the goal of uh, right meow is to try and get omni geodes because we want to be able to purchase uh, the artifact caches, which in theory. should help us uh, achieve the goals of finishing the museum. Whether it will or not, I, I don't know. Uh, ooh, an auto grabber! Not that great, but it's good. I wish it was an auto petter, but I'll take a grabber. Ooh. Took you a couple hours, but we were finally able to get a nap in. Well, that's good. That usually helps. Do that. That. We don't need... Holy guacamole, Batman. What are you doing, you fool? That's better. Hey, Tank and Chat. I've been lurking lately, Yvette! I hope you're doing well. Oh, why am I stopping at level 200? Prismatic Sword! That's a good sign so far. Oh, he's missed the lives, Caitlin! 
Uh, because YouTube never sends notifications, but I'm so happy I finally caught you. Yes. Nice. Yeah, YouTube does not love my channel. But, uh, it's because of the way I run it. And, uh, it's fine. But I'm glad you're here. We should be getting back onto our solid stream schedule. So just know, ladies and gentlemen, I apologize that I run my YouTube channel in the worst way possible for notifications. Uh, but from now on, we should always be live streaming at, f at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If not, there's some kind of technical difficulty or something like that. Uh, that is preventing me from doing so. That's usually the best way to, to be able to make sure to make live streams. Is just come at the time that you know we should be streaming. Uh, and you can always see one scheduled on the homepage too. So like... Um, you can always see, like, you, I usually try and get them scheduled, like, an hour before the stream. So by 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I typically have a stream scheduled if we're going to be able to stream. So it's usually the best way to be able to do it. Uh, Caitlin, thank you for becoming a super bean! And the ghosts seem to always drop the Omni Geodes like they're hot. Somebody was saying that in the last live stream as well. So maybe we should just farm up the ghost layers then. But we're getting Omni Geodes today. We were not the other day. Tech difficulties or cat difficulties? Exactly. Ooh, Caitlin with the purple Corgo. Getting them sweet, sweet geodes, baby. The problem was before, we were having all the bad luck days. So just the chances of us getting Omni Geodes were also lower. So I'm going to go out on a limb and say that the drop rate for Omni Geodes is affected by the luck of that day as well. Because we're getting plenty of Omni Geodes now. Next time you tease the plush, I'm gonna need you to squish the bag. Oh yeah, squeeze it. <laughs> Let me see it squish. How did the Stardew Valley server test go today? Uh, very well. So for those of you that don't know what's going on, I have plans to make a large, unlimited player Stardew Valley server or multiple of them. Um, depending on how many people we should have on a server. Because I feel like, like, unlimited players is great. But 60 is probably the most you would want on a server. Like, depending on the size and things like that. So, hopefully be able to host multiple servers with different types of mods and things like that. Um, and today was the first test of what will be the first real version of, like, an always-on unlimited player server that doesn't have tons of issues. Uh, so today was the first test of that, which I'm incredibly excited about. And I'll be able to share a lot more information on that very, very soon. It'll probably be a few weeks before we'll fully, uh, uh, fully have it up and going, though. Rainbow Caroline! Sweet Caroline, what it do? Welcome back, you wonderful bean. How have you been? Wait, plushie update? If we get to 500 likes, I will give a plushie update. I will pull that plushie out of the bag and let you gaze upon its majestic plushie nature. like the stream started watching uh your videos a week ago when you popped up into my suggested first i've been able to catch welcome man youtube out here suggesting stuff Ooh, baby nice show us a leg hold on hold on y'all want a little bit of a pre we're not we're nowhere near hold on i need to pause the game uh we'll do this Give you a little sneak a rooski. Toe beans. Toe 
hoe beans. <laughs> Show us the bag again. <laughs> How dare you tease us with the toe beans? Only beans dot com. Oh, my prospector senses are tingling. Holy God, are we about to die? Holy Jesus. Kid, what are you doing, dude? <laughs> what did you break? This is how a cat teases its prey. Oh, you got exploded. Kaden. Caden got banned from his uh, switch, so now he's all up in my grill. Which I do love spending time with my boy. But... You know what you're not supposed to do. Jack out here trying to give people a foot. Just a toe bean fetish. I mean, there's worse fetishes to have. How much ice cream would we need to provide for Caden to grab the plushie and share it with us? Oh. Bribes. Caden says five cookies and cream. I mean, not cookies and cream, mint chocolate chip. Mint chocolate chip? Yeah. Oh my lord. Lord have mercy. Just want to get to level four. Ooh! Mmm, dish of the sea. A tourist recorded themselves like the bean in Chicago. So now the locals have a hashtag don't lick the bean going around and it's as cringe as possible. Oh my Lord. <laughs> Sweet baby Jesus. No more, no less. Oh. Level 4 hundy, let's go! Here's some cookies and cream and mint chocolate chip money. Oh my lord. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Sweet baby Jesus. Out here trying to give him the beatus. All the damage. Ooh, a hole. Ooh, this was a good level to fall to. This should have all the Omni Geodes. Or not. Or not. It's a bit of a bummer. I don't have any bombs left. win-win. I support the five cookies and cr uh, cream ice cream, so here's some monies. Mint chocolate chip is a crime against humanity. <laughs> he likes pineapple pizza and mint chocolate chip. I don't know what to tell you. Don't know what to tell you. Although, I do have to say I did like mint chocolate chip when I was younger as well. But I don't think at any point in time I liked... Uh, pineapple pizza. And I only got one prismatic shard today, too. I am most certainly cursed. He's a visionary. Don't you get his ego going. It's the last thing he needs. Ooh. Level 4 hundy.
Whoops. Alright, well, we got some geodes. Pineapple pizza and mint chocolate chip ice cream rule. Oh my lord, Jamie. What a bad influence. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you, Jamie. Thank you. Alright, maybe for that, you get another toe. Get another toe. Wait, maybe the tail? Just a just a little tail? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So this is the uh this oh wait, I said I promised I would squish the bag. It's a thicken. It's a thicken. Maybe you can see a little bit of a uh, an eye. <laughs> <clears throat> Whoops. The squishmallow strip tease. For those that don't know, this is the uh, the Aragon uh, plushie that will be uh, released very soon. Oh yeah, there's a good squish. <laughs> oh my lord, tag this is wrong site for tail action. Hey. You got to get the action where the action is getting. Just a little tail. What kind of channel is this? Y'all got such dirty minds. I went to the ice level and the regular mines got 128 omni geodes, traded them and was able to finish my museum. Oh my god. All right, well I guess did you do? Did you get 128 Omni Geodes in one day, Lori? Has Aragon seen his plush? He has. He was not impressed. In fact, some would say he was displeased. Distraught, even. His eyes were agape. His tag continues to tease his loyal members. We gotta get 700 people watching before I can feel it. I feel like the Aragon plushie deserves 700 people to be watching when it's unveiled. Unveiled? Unveiled like veal parmesan? After years of grinding in vanilla, I'm finally playing fully modded Stardew. I feel unstoppable! Zozo! Zozo the Great, destroyer of worlds, keeper of time and mods. That is awesome. I'm glad you're having so much fun. That is such, such good news. Jamie with the five gift subs. Thank you so much. Was that 700 watching and 500 likes? Nah, just 700 watching. I don't think we're going to get there, though, because YouTube keeps me in a turd nugget. I have other words that I would love to say about YouTube at the moment. Like, as far as, like, what's going on with the, the site today. I think Google was having issues all day, because we were having some issues testing some other things today. Um, I think Google's just having some struggles. But, Jamie, thank you so much for the gift memberships, you wonderful bean. There, I liked it twice. Oh, my lord. Lord have mercy. I did hear about the Aragon series coming on Disney Plus. Super exciting. Very excited. Wait, is one of the mods broken? What? Did I boot the game? I booted the game with mods. Why didn't I get any fancy jelly? Gooey. Mayor Lewis. Oh, wait. Tomorrow is the fe- Okay, so we need to get the gift for Emily. I forgot. All right, so that'll be a good gift. That'll be a good day tomorrow. Um, So we've got that. We need to go get more monies. 
At 400, do we get an ear? Maybe. I tagged this month is going great. Got a new kitten. And our first me and my sis going to see Christopher a K-pop concert. Ooh, nice. I hope you both have a fan freaking fantastic time. That is awesome. Spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Fantastic. Fantastic. Now we gotta fill those up. Gotta get more money. Oh, money mo better. What is the challenge? We got to make 2 million gold by the end of this season. Like 2 million gold in, in cash in our pockets. We got to buy the scepter. Uh, I have to finish the museum. We already married Sam, so that's good. And I have to finish our full blown dinosaur pen, uh, which we are very close to completing. So all in all, the, the the main thing that I'm concerned about is the museum, because I waited too long to... Well, I sold over a hundred Omni Geodes, which is a problem. And then, um... And I have not been able to get more. So I'm a little concerned about that. I reached the Noble Rainbow Corgi. Thanks, Tag, for being awesome. Aw. Thank you, Yolanda. You wonderful bean. Alright, we gotta pet the chonks. They feeling chunky, chunky but donkey. Right, there we go. Um, and then uh, we got to start wooing literally everybody. It's the year of love next. Love shark, baby. Love shark, baby. Love shark. Love shark. It's gonna be a love shack. We're gonna have everybody in the club up in here. And then maybe we'll even upgrade our farms so we can get more animals and stuff. Stream's so nice, I liked it twice, but who am I? <laughs> Ah, oh, sweet baby Jesus. All right, we can, at the very least, uh, go turn in these geodes. Let's see how those work. Ghosts in the Skull Cavern had a 99% chance of dropping Omni Geodes. Interesting. I'm now 34 weeks pregnant this week, and I need this baby out of me. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> what is a good advice to a noob YouTube streamer? Uh, study. Understand everything about the platform. That is, uh, the best advice that I can give. And, uh, don't give up. And also, you can't just stream. Like, you can. Actually, on YouTube, you can get away with just streaming, but you have to target things that are trending if you just want to do just streaming. Like new games that come out. And you got to become an authority on those. But it's the best thing to do is to make tutorials and stream. Or cover viral content. And, uh, you just got to study. The more you understand the algorithm, the easier it'll be. Getting to catch your stream live while working, so take my hush money. Oh, snap. My lips are sealed. Happy 25 months, Jennifer! I've been grinding Stardew Valley Vanilla on Switch, but now I think I'm ready to expand to Stardew Valley Expanded. Oh, snap. And all I'm saying is, if you don't complete the museum, then I don't see a single thing. As in, there was no failure. Oh, there was a failure. You have to leverage all the different types of content, social media, things like that. Turn your long form videos into short form content, which I don't do because I'm lazy. Actually, I don't do that because 
There's actually a good reason why I, I do, like it seems like I'm doing my channel a disservice the way I do it, uh, but they actually finally separated the algorithms for streaming and videos. So the reason I can get away with streaming without killing my channel is because now what I do is I stream when there aren't new trending games to cover. And then, oh, we got an ancient seed. And then, so that allows me to stream and do whatever I want. And then when a new game comes out, like Animal Crossing or Elden Ring or like Hogwarts Legacy that's coming up, I can cover those games. And uh, the way I do with like tutorials and stuff. It's all complicated craziness. Okay, well that didn't work very well. I feel like those artifact troves, getting one artifact out of an artifact trove is a little terrible like why does it just give you rarer ones is that what it is i mean it did in fact give me ones i didn't have but only three wait did you cover elden ring yes torrents torrents although i only got to cover elden ring for like a week and a half which sucked Blueprints for crafting agent seeds. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. How does that work? Oh, it's just one agent. Oh, I get it. It only gives artifacts. I mean, I guess that's fair. I feel like one of my other places is ready to harvest. Ooh, we're almost to 700. Show off that thick, squishy baby. I need your personal anvil mod. That way, no paying that dude to open things. Oh my lord. That would be like heaven. All right, when does this stuff finish? Four days, winter 28. I guess we'll spend the rest of the day in the regular mines. And try and... Uh, Y'all said going through the the ice levels would be the best, right? Oh, Selzy, nice. Dinkum is so good. I was actually I wanted to play Dinkum today, but I decided not to, uh, just due to the sole fact that uh, we had not been playing a lot of Stardew, and I wanted to to finish our Stardew Stardewy goodness. I think that's going to get us pretty dang close. Between all of this, I think we're on the cusp of getting that 2,000 or 2 million gold. Like, that achievement seems well within grasp now. I was getting a little worried there when we installed that other mod from the, uh, from the mod roulette that drastically reduced our income. But I'm feeling pretty okay about it now. Especially once we sell this. I'm going to keep the rabbit's foots on me for gifts because I want to start wooing everybody now. I always forget that this is literally right there. Oh, you know what else I can sell too? I can sell all of that. That's like almost 100,000 gold right here. That's 79,000 gold or something like that. I think we Gucci. I could be wrong. You can also sell your body. Whoa. This ain't that kind of channel yet. What are we doing? <laughs> yet 
Hey, you never know what's going to happen on the internet. One day you're relevant and the next day you're not. Did you see the Buzz Lightyear movie? I did. I watched it uh, last night and today with uh, with Caden. I didn't think it was bad. Oh, we did it. We did it. All right. We need some... Uh, I need some non-copyright, like, earth, wind, and fire or something. 703. All right. Are you, are you prepared? The bag's coming off. So for those of you that don't know, uh, we finally got our makeshift Squishmallow in. Our, uh... This is our Aragon plushie. The first plushie we're ever doing, in fact. It's the first plushie we're ever doing. Kaden, what are you doing? Um, and we're partnering with Makeship on it. This will be available soon. But this is the first review. This is the review copy. I finally got it. And I'm super excited. I'm not bragging or anything. But I personally think this might be the best stuffy that Makeship has ever made. Okay. It's beautiful. It's the Aragon plushie. From the time... So there was a live stream last year where every time I laughed, I had to buy something that the community recommended on Amazon. And one of the things that the community recommended was this little cap. And we put it on... Once we got it in the mail, we put it on poor Aragon. And... It was the day that Aragon stopped trusting me. He's never trusted me since. And this is the stuffy that was made after that. So he's got a nice little, he's got a flat butt so he can sit all nicely. The hat was my fault. Uh, he's squishy. Very squish. Um, yeah. He's got, look, look, look at the little toe beans. The toe beans are adorable. I didn't know about the toe beans until I took it out of the bag, and I was like, oh, my God. Um, so, yeah, these will be available very soon. There'll be a pre-order up for them. Uh, but very excited about the, the Squishmallow. It's so good. Came out so good. Like, better than I could have even imagined. I'm getting the face one. <laughs> Smell it. <laughs> Love it. I should put this on my wedding registry. Did you ever imagine that one day you'd be selling freaking plushies? No. <laughs> I did not. How big is the pre-order going to be? Uh, so there'll be $27.99 plus shipping and handling. Um... Which, for a stuffy, especially that big and of that quality, I was looking around, like, Ashley's been buying stuffies that are, like, 30, 40 bucks. Uh, so I feel like it's a, it's in a pretty decent price range. I forgot my bombs. God dang it. Um, and the pre-order period will be for, uh, 30 days? Am I at the wrong levels for this? What levels did you guys say I needed to go to? I don't want to waste the time. Was it... 40? The plushie is perfect. Nice levels. Nice levels, so 40. And then are y'all saying just to fight the ghosts? Of course there would be no ghosts. Need a matching Shafi, Shafi if it goes well? Yeah. We just have to... We just have to have it go well and we'll be able to make as many plushies as we want. Uh, which will be great. Bomb everything? I don't have any bombs. I'll go buy some bombs real quick. Wonder how much shipping will be from the butt of the earth? I don't know. I'd have no idea. 
Uh, you could find out by going to makeshift and looking at the other things that they have there, and you'll get a, a decent idea. Uh, we do have to... So the pre-orders will be... We need to sell 500 of them or they won't make them. Uh, is, the, is the bit of the bummer part. So hopefully we can sell that many. I'm not. I I really have to make sure to advertise it because I'm. I hate self advertising and things like that. But I have to if we want the plushies to be made. So. Bam, 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 bam. Can I have all five hundred? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Tag, for what you do. This is a great community, plus plushies. Basically, the, the reason why they put limits on it is because you have to order a certain amount or you can't make a profit from it. Uh, like, for instance, with the prints that we just did, I didn't sell enough prints, uh, so I ended up having to pay the higher price for them, which means I actually lost money on every print that I sold for the print store. But it was at least a good test. <laughs> Thank you, Scott. <laughs> so you cannot do prints anymore because of that? No, I can. Like, I don't mind losing money on the prints. It's fine. The, uh... Because y'all got all the blankets, so it's like, uh, it offsets, it's fine. Blank the blankets are cozy. Do, 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 do. Alright, I'm not getting any Omni Geodes. I feel like I've been lied to. The Bone Quarry on Ginger Island has lots of Omni Geodes too. Some people have said that, but I didn't get any from that. And I've got none from the ice level so far either. <laughs> Ooh, the desk mat came in. Nice. I actually just got my desk mat too. I'm not using it yet because the cats keep spilling stuff on my desk, uh, but it came out really, really good. And the blankets are freaking fire. Like the blankets are absolutely amazing. Shipping to the UK looks like it'll be $8.99. That's not bad at all. That's still cheaper than most plushies, so that's that's pretty good. That makes me feel a lot better about it. Have all the prints shipped yet? Um, I think the last batch is being printed and being shipped. $8.99 to uh, Butt of the Earth 2? Hell yeah. Carbon ghosts are 31 to 39. Thank you, Torrance. What's the company that made the plush? Makeship. So saying carbon ghosts, these guys. Is that what you're talking about? I feel like I just have the worst luck ever. Hmm. I mean, at least we're learning. Oh, I saw one. I won. It's okay, bud. We gotta go to bed. All right. Well, I'm going to stop listening to chat about these Omni Geodes now, and I'm just going to do it the way that has been working for us, which is the Skull Cavern. <laughs> we just wasted a whole day. But it was a bad luck day, so it wasn't really a waste. Not too bad, not too bad. I 
I'd never got Omni Geos from Ghosts, just the White Ghosts. Oh, we gotta go! So we got the lucky foot. Emily likes lucky foots, right? Feets? Foots? Footies? Footy booties? Oh! 319,863. 401,000. We just did it. We've got the warp rod, my friends. And we've got the money till the end. We did it. We did it. Victory is ours. All right. Now that we don't have to focus on money anymore. You said she likes the amethyst. All right. Well, I've got one of those in my pocket place. So that's good. Bam, 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 bam. And we've still got all of this money right here. All right. I did not... Well, to be fair, we've made almost, what, 6.3 million gold this year. We've had a really good year, to be fair. Um... There was just a lot of shenaniganry afoot that I kept spending money on rather than saving it for the scepter, so... Um, I did not need to make it as stressful as I did, but life choices are life choices, you know? Just the way the cookies crumble. Oh my god, 43 iridium starfruit jelly. 3100 gold each. Holy lord. Neon Batman, thank you! Actually, it's Thursday. I could save those. I'm gonna save the Iridium ones. More monies? All the money. All that glitters is starfruit. Can we uh, pre-order the plush on your website? Not yet. I gotta, uh, I gotta get the exact date for it. I believe it'll be timed for the end of the month, since we just did, like the uh, the merch store. I want to give everybody a little bit of a a chance before, because we only have thirty days uh, for the plush. I want to record some videos for it and all that stuff too. So, game night tonight, Adi. It's like, oh, today is Thursday. Oh my god, is it? Um, I don't know if we're gonna do it tonight on and I only say that because I'm still just absolutely beat from uh, from our trip barely had energy to start the stream today <clears throat> I thought it was like Tuesday <laughs> I'm not mentally prepared but maybe Tomorrow instead? Perhaps, yeah. I don't see why not. Hexagon rematch. <laughs> we do have to play some more Fall Guys. Oh my lord. Okay, so that's Abigail. Today is the time to be thankful. All right, so where is Emily at right now? Oh, there she is. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I put it... I put it away. All right. A rabbit's foot, thanks. So we gave her the gold quality rabbit's foot. Oh, I cannot believe I did that.
Man, oh man. Oh, it's Maeve. Never had her as a gift giver before. Well, open it. What you got, Maeve? Ooh, an emerald. Nice. It's nothing fancy, but it's the best I could afford. Hey, uh, uh, it's fine with me. Talk to our boo thing. You know, we haven't figured out how to have the date yet. I don't know how the date mod works. Hmm. Nothing fancy gives you a gem, right? No prismatic shard. How dare she? What else are we going to sell? Oh, date night. There's a chance each day they'll come outside and ask you when you leave the house. Oh, so they ask us on a date. Well, well, well. Okay. That's cool. That weird dance of the farm was one of your dates, was it? <laughs> <gasps> Starry eyed, we already showed the plushie. Oh my lord, where were ya? Lord have mercy. Tease it again. <laughs> I can't, I can't. These preservation jars really saved us. They really, really did. Michael Keane, thank you for the super chat. Get the scepter before you spend more money. <laughs> yes, we're going to go do that right now. We're going to see if it's a good luck day. Uh, we're going to go pay Krovis a visit. Krovis is going to be rolling in the dough. Just rolling thick. I was asleep in Dingo Land, so I didn't see the plushie. Are you hyped about uh, Aragon on Disney Plus? I am. I really hope it's not terrible. Uh, but the Christopher Paolini is uh, going to be assisting writing it too, which I think is awesome. Maybe give a plushy peek at the end of the stream for those who missed it. Oh, I got you. Don't worry. Michael Keane, thank you so much again. Thank you. So when are you going to try pineapple pizza? I'll have to do it during our next like in-person uh, live stream. I think would be best. There we go. Starfruit jelly, starfruit jelly. I forgot what I was doing. Oh, she gave me Salad. Sir Zach the Dudeson. Thank you for becoming a majestic bean. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, so those are going to be done in a day. Oh, we got to see if it's a good luck day. We need a bigger TV. Spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed. God dang it, I cannot catch a break. All right, well, we're slowly filling this up with the right things. Oh, man. 
mildly perturbed. Gotta see Tag's face when he takes the first bite. Just this poison. Pure poison. Alright, let's go uh, pay Torts a visit. I want to give some gifts out for the people that we want to woo. Um, so I need to start carrying the fairy stones around. Prismatic shards and rabbit's feet. Pretty much at all times, I need some of those things. Because if our boo never wants to go on a date with us, we're going to have to find somebody who's going to want to go on a date with us. Oh, Lord. That plush is ginormous and everything I wished it would be. Now to figure out a good reason why I need more than two. <laughs> oh, no. Well, the good reason is because then we can have a whole line of plushes if the first one does well. We can do one of Safi. We could do one of me, my Stardew Valley character, I think. Something like that. We need, uh, we just need somebody to design the, uh, the plushes. Top hat tag or babushka tag? The one of the motherless go. I think the babushka tag would be pretty awesome. Oh, did I just leave my horse? Why is Pam on the lift? That's illegal. You're seconding the motherless goat. We could do a, a thick motherless goat. That'd be pretty cool. Although I don't know how large of an audience that would appeal to. <laughs> I'm down to sketch some more plushie designs. <gasps> at you suspiciously. It's a very torts thing to do. The, uh... Let's see here. Where was our... Is the... Is there still a plush section? Where was that? I want to look at the other plush designs, but I don't see it anymore. Was it under art? Is that where it was? I don't know. They're all, like, gone for some reason. <laughs> A goat with attitude, though. Your centaur weirds me out. My centaur brings all the horses to the yard. Or something like that. All right, let's go to Krobus before I forget. I was about to go spend my money. I wear my motherless goat sweatshirt all the time. It gets many compliments. <laughs> Hell yeah. It was under announcements. Deleted it in May. Shows up under change logs. Whoops. Uh, what did I just gift Krobus? Oh, one of you, like, three. Interesting. Return scepter! Let's go! What is the story behind Motherless Goat? I can't swear. Well, I can swear. I quite enjoy swearing. But uh, I don't like... I don't enjoy uh, 
ad revenue being like literally. So like, let's, let's put it this way. Like a video that you swear in, or if you don't, let's say you make $10 in a video and you didn't swear. If you do swear, chances are that video is then go, instead of making $10 might make like a dollar or $2 because it has to do with, uh, with ads. So as much as I enjoy cursing, cause it's good for your soul. Uh, it's not good for anything else. Uh, hence motherless goat. You could probably figure out from there what that stands for. <laughs> also, I just enjoy saying it. Cause it takes people, it goes, it, it, it's, it's, it's evolved beyond that now. But that's how it started. Sometimes, though, the censoring of the cursing brings forth amazing creativity. It's true. <gasps> what happened? How? What? Did I? Didn't I replant this whole field during one of our streams and it was supposed to. Oh my lord. I am so glad that we hit our goal. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's painful. All right, well, we're going to have to fix that. Oh, my Lord. Just picked the star fruit and left. Wow. I cannot believe I did that. Oh, that's rough. Alright, well, we're gonna have to buy more seeds. We don't have money for that right now. That and butter my butt and call me a biscuit. <laughs> yeah. I love this. Thank you so much. I got you, fam. Good day to you. Good day to you, madam. How are you this fine evening day thing? Hello? Would you like a foot of the rabbit? Oh, you would. Oh, good. This is my favorite thing. <gasps> She's not being so rude. It's a Chris. Do you have a pony on your farm? Oh, you like to ride the. <laughs> Why a pony though? Why not? A f I have a full blown Abigail horse. Oops. <laughs> the meme covers up stuff during our uh, game nights or during Fall Guys is what it is. To hide the code during Fall Guys. Maybe. Oh, what's this question mark for? How am I not good friends with Abigail? I literally ride her to work every day. Do I have it hotkeyed to F1? Yeah. Yeah. So when I hit F1, it pops up. And I've known it for a while. I just don't feel like fixing it. <laughs> Maybe that's why. Thanks for the gift, farmer. Let me through the door, you dirty... Oh, my God. Andy. Andy. Bro. Bro. Demetrius. God dang it. Not you, Lewis. God dang it, Bobby.
One salad. <gasps> Sophia's getting turned. Does she like rabbit's foots? Yes. No, she likes prismatic shards. Boom. Man, we friend an everybody in the club today. Who's that floozy behind the bar? Who is that floozy behind the bar? Who are you? It's Corinne. <laughs> well, hello, madame. We're going to keep Pam drunk and happy. Boop, boop. Ooh, you can marry her? I think so. Did I need this? Yes, I did. This is a family game, yes? I don't know what I'm going to call it. How close am I to completing the museum? Not close enough. Definitely not close enough. Unfortunately, the museum... I waited. Waited a little too long to uh to work on do i know exactly what i need for the museum no i need i think like 20 some 20 or more items ish i would say ashley dawn thank you for the four months How do you get star fruit? Uh, from the desert. Um, you need a bomb. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's see here. We need to hatch some eggs. Stephanie G, thank you for becoming a super bean. God dang it, I left it up again. Lizard! Uh, we're going to call this Lizzie the Lizard. Lizzie the quote unquote lizard. And we got a lot of uh, eggs up in here. Is all of these eggs? These are all my little dino babies. <gasps> oh my God. Didn't I name one Lizzie last time? Um, 
I'm going to name this one Paprika to keep you quiet. Bulbasaur Pog. <laughs> of course it's trying to sleep. Dang it. All right, I think we got all of the uh, dinos now. Why do they keep And we'll name this one Caden. <laughs> he says name one Bulbasaur and I'll be quiet. Because I wanted to, boy. My friend wanted to divorce Shane immediately because a section of the house is messy. <laughs> oh, man. How much are dino eggs worth? Not bad. Mm -hmm. Do I have any star fruits hidden anywhere? I guess not. All right. I thought I saved some, but clearly I was mistaken. Make Dino Mayo. Level 11 farming? Wait, what? Okay, then. Didn't know that was a thing. 200,000. You're afraid to ask what dino mayo is? It's mayo of the dino variety. I just feel like sleeping. Aw. Fortune teller, come on. Good luck there. 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 Good luck. Oh my god. How are they so angry? <clears throat> uh My lord. How is this possible? We've had no good luck days. Why is your TV in the middle of the kitchen? Why isn't your TV in the middle of the kitchen? Buck, 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 buck. Buck, 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 buck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh yeah, perfect. Building's <laughs> full. Whoops. All right, so we've got all the little dino babies. I just got to move everything at this point. It's like, name my, my baby pig. <laughs> name your pig. What? Snuffleupagus? Alright, so we need to farm up Omni Geodes, right? We need to farm up Omni Geodes. We need to pet off thick buns. Alright, 
everything in there is growing. We good. Where did my horse go? She's all the way over there. Had the server stress test go earlier. Uh, actually went really, really, really well. Mines? Yes. Snufflefagus. Oh no. <laughs> Not quite right. Oh my lord. <laughs> I don't have a super cucumber yet, unfortunately. Uh, but I will try and get one. I don't know if I'll try and get one this year, though. Mainly because uh, I got so many other things I still got to focus on. Alright, where's Pam at? Let's go, Pam! So we need to find dude bros, the ghosts. Oh, we need so much. So many geodes, so little time. You have a super cu cucumber pond from year one. You know, I haven't even caught a super cucumber yet. I think this is the longest time I've gone without catching one. Ooh, 15 starfruit seeds. Hot diggity dang. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Turbo, Barbo, what it do? How are you doing today, you wonderful bean? I wonder if it's a feature of Stardew Valley Expanded. What's that, dances? Just had some authentic ramen. Woo! Nice. Need me some of that. And with fire right now, good lord. Does mods work on mobile? You can, in fact, get mods to work on mobile. Uh, I'm sure there are tutorials on how to do it. I don't believe it's very difficult either. But yes, Android only, uh, not on iOS.
Rule of thumb is if you ever want to do anything fun, don't get anything Apple related. You hush, sir. <laughs> Andy, oh no. Don't apple shame me. I will apple shame everyone. Always having to uh, answer questions about apple. Just cannot catch a break. Ain't no ghosts where I roam. Oh, there's one. Apple and Mac is great when you have multiple devices. Yeah, we were talking about phones. just happened huh okay then oh my lord you think your Lenovo laptop would be able to run Stardew I'm, or modded Stardew probably I mean, depending on how old it is I cannot believe I only got six Omni Geodes so far up oh, seven let's go we need about, uh, I don't know, a hundred more. Give or take a hundred. The only thing that really happens is it takes longer to load with modded Stardew. put modded stardew played stardew on a steam deck i have and modded stardew works really really well actually very well oh my god our first prismatic show today well not today but in the mines today Skirt. looked like it was going to like trail down into like a secret or something. I was like, oh, what is this? What is the difference with mod stardew? M mods. It depends on the mod. Can very much change the game. Like we have a elevator in the mines right now. Or in Skull Cavern.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, I do believe we are going to fail the museum side of our challenge, unfortunately. But otherwise, not so bad. <clears throat> I'm actually going to go and reset my mining level because I want to be able to get different mining skills. I think it's a little late for it, but... Ah, yeah, the museum part of the challenge we failed. Unfortunate, but true. What's the consequences of failure? That's a good question. I don't know. We need the cone of shame. I just have to keep the cone of shame on until we uh until we fix this, you know? I feel like that's the uh the proper punishment. I can marry everyone except Robin. That's so sad. That's so sad. I guess I'll have to just eat pineapple pizza on stream for a hundred percent sure now. Smooches? No? No smooches? Dang it. Alright, I'm ready for winter to be over. The final day of winter, ladies and gentlemen. We've accomplished all the things but one of the things. <laughs> oh man, Sam wasn't even in bed. Sam's like, this human disgusts me. Smooches. Actually, I'm gonna keep the jelly because we don't need to sell it. I got the scepter. I did get the scepter. Pineapple pizza fund? Oh my lord. Yeah, I'm trying to get Sam to max hearts. Cat, could you get your giant cat butt out of my face? Thank you. Dude, what are you doing? These cats, I swear. You're working on the scepter and the walnuts. We'll have to do the walnuts. I don't know if we're going to do the, the walnut one. Because the walnut just kind of dedicates us to doing the same exact thing for like an entire year. Uh, which I don't think would be necessarily super fun to watch. I think us wooing the whole town might be fun though. Oh, the cats definitely missed us when I... Dude, stop licking my stuff. Cats are not meant to drink energy drinks. What are you doing? Why are you like this? Huh? You're a giant, fluffy disaster. Know that? Giant, fluffy disaster. Is there anyone's cutscenes you've never seen? Uh, pretty much everybody's. Did I not bring my horse out here? What's wrong with me? Did I, wa I walked out here? What you gonna do with that big cat butt? Oh, you know what I'm gonna do. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. What you gonna do with that big cat butt? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. How 
many seeds we got? 42. And I could just go buy more. Now that we do have money. My husband thinks it's weird that I started singing that to my dog and cat. <laughs> the best. Alright. I feel like that's pretty good. 127? That'll at least be enough for that one area. Have you ever used the Aspen mod for Stardew Valley? Uh, no, I've actually never heard of that mod, Sarah. Believe it or not. Perfect. This is what I was waiting for so I could clean up all of these. And we're going to move these into our other area. Because we need to prep the farm for Biggly Wiggly stuff this season. We also have to, like, really beautify it in year three, I think. I miss kitty cam. Yeah, the cats won't sit still for streams anymore now. It adds a new NPC, has her own farm above the train area. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty cool. The hoe can remove multiple machines if you have it upgraded. Oh. Lord have mercy. The power of hoe. Well, the last day of winter is going pretty well for us, I think. Just getting to chill like a villain. All of our cheese and everything. Iridium cheese. I kind of like the setup we've got going on here with all the star fruits and everything. I feel like this has been going pretty well for us. Yeah, I had no idea. Oh no. Dang it. Whoops. I think we're just going to have to waste those star fruits, unfortunately. Oh, oh, no. Okay, that's fine. Whew. I thought we were about to destroy our hard work. God, 70 star fruit jelly. About to be rolling in the dough. Then we have 106 preservation jars. Wow. All right, so the goal here, preservation jars instead of kegs in here. Because we get increased value, but it doesn't take as long as a keg. And I kind of like that. Whoops. And we can fit a lot of them in here. Oh, 
Wish you could mod the Switch. Yeah. It'd be pretty sweet. Would be super cool. Wow, we can actually put a ton of preservation jars in here. I did not realize just how big this area was. Wow, okay, we can even we can make even more. You should leave a space at the left end for future walking convenience, maybe. Cause we'll just plow stuff through this way, go all the way through that loop, all the way up to the top. Sarah, what'd it do? Maybe you need to play Stardew again. That'll help with the nursing school stress. 100%. 100%. Best idea ever. All right. Welp. This brings us to the end of winter. We achieved all of our goals but one. And next year is going to be crazy. The real question is, we have so many other games. Do we want to do a year three now, or do we want to give uh, Stardew a little bit of a break so that way people can catch up to the whole series so far? Or I don't know. We have a lot of options for what we can do. Let's go ahead and just bring it to spring. I feel like we got everything set up. Pretty good shape. Oh, actually, I know what I wanted to do. Play Ranch Sim. Got to do year three. I mean, we're going to do year three, but the question is, do we play like Baron Breakfast? We have like three other games right now. We've got Cult of Lamb coming out. So the real question is, do we give Stardew Valley a little bit of a break? So that way we can uh, play all that. And plus, we're going to have the uh, uh, the other Stardew Valley series starting very soon, too. But maybe we'll keep it to like one Stardew stream. Oh, I don't know. I'm trying to figure it out. Uh, I vote don't year three now. I mean, we're not going to do, we're not going to start year three right now. We are going to 100% do year three though. Cause I'm excited for year three, like super excited for year three. Um, I just want to give people a chance to catch up to the whole series so far. Cause we got a lot of, uh, we got a lot of videos. The Stardew Sundays. Stardew Sunday sounds like a pretty fire time to me. Saints Row on the 23rd. I'm so behind on other streams. <laughs> Play until Chocolatier comes out. I mean, Chocolatier is going to be probably a couple of years out still. I could be wrong. Level 12 farming. Level 13 farming. Well, we've done it. Spring is upon us. Oh, Grandpappy! My dear boy, it's been many years since we last spoke. You were just a little boy, do you remember? Look how far you've come. Though you may have forgotten me, I've been here all along. You see, my body has departed this world, 
but my heart will always remain in Stardew Valley. Grim puppy. <clears throat> You've been here two years now. I'm so proud of you, my boy. You're a better farmer than I ever was, and you've brought great honor to the family name. I can feel it now. My spirit is finally put to rest. Bless you. Nice. The future of Chonky Cow Farm is in your hands. <laughs> Farewell. Aw, Grandpappy. So, do we have the four Grandpappies of approval? Oh. Yep. Boom. The four grandpappies of approval. Oh. Oh, we're going on a date. Hey, McThickums. I just wanted to wish you a happy spring. The time is just flying by. Every day with you is amazing, dear. Aww. Ooh, giving me a gift. A freaking flower. Hell yeah. Are we going on a date? I know it's a little cheesy, but would you like to dance with me? It'll be just me and you together in front of the farm and cha <laughs> that changed our lives. Oh, this is the same thing as before. I guess we'll dance. You can dance if you want to. You can touch Sam's behind. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so I think that's just Sam's uh, date, is that. Good lord. The statue... Of perfection. Nice. It's made of pure iridium. Hail yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so very much for hanging out with me, you wonderful, wonderful beings. I hope each and every one of you have a fantastic day. And, uh, see you all in the next one.